Well, welcome to week eight of our online worship service at Ambassador. I'm so glad you've joined in today, and I want to remind you that there's a, a worship guide you can access along with these videos on our webpage at ambassadorprez.org. And there you can also find links to children's bulletins and a children's lesson video. You can also join together with others at 1015 a.m. on Sunday via Zoom as we go through the service uh, together as God's people. If you have any trouble accessing these resources, please contact the church office and let us know. We're happy to assist you with that. Well, I pray that these times of worship, praising God in song, coming to God in prayer, and hearing from God in the teaching of his word, are encouraging and uplifting to you each week. I also pray that you are finding time and seeing opportunities to grow in grace and be strengthened in your faith during the week as you connect with others, both from church and in your neighborhoods. I just remind you that we have a number of opportunities that for that during the week. We are uh, continuing to meet on Wednesdays at 6.30 p.m. for a time of prayer together. I invite you to be a part of that. Our middle school and high school youth are gathering Sunday nights at 7 p.m. Uh, men, you're invited to a Bible study on Tuesday morning at 7.30. And ladies, uh, to our women's Bible study on Tuesday nights at 7 o'clock. Um, also, beginning this week, uh, moms, you are invited to a drop-in time of fellowship uh, starting this Monday night from 8 to 9.30 p.m. Just come when you can. It's simply a time for moms to, to wind down and, and catch up with one another and encourage each other. All of those gatherings and meetings will take place on Zoom and you can get links for each of those meetings in our weekly e-letter, uh, the emails that are going out, or you can uh, contact the office and we'll be happy to let you know how to log on to those. We'll also be doing another food drive pickup for With Love from Jesus, so be on the lookout for that uh, information uh, this week. Once again, um, please let us know how we can pray for you. Uh, if you have any needs or there are other ways we can serve you, we uh, continue to wanna um, be able to minister in whatever way we can. Uh, our ambassador, uh, to our ambassador family, I just want you to know how much I miss seeing you and look forward to, to being back together. And to any guests or friends who may be watching this, uh, I'm really glad you're here. And I hope to meet you in person soon. And I want to encourage you to feel free to reach out uh, via our website if you have any questions uh, or needs that we can help meet. And now I want to encourage us to turn our hearts to the Lord in worship as we hear his call to worship from Psalm 67. Let the peoples praise you, O God. Let all the peoples praise you. Let the nations be glad and sing for joy. For you judge the peoples with equity, and you guide the nations upon the earth. Let the peoples praise you, O God. Let all the peoples praise you. Will you join me in prayer? Father God in heaven, we join our hearts and we lift our voices together as your people to praise you. O oh God, we ascribe to you, O oh Lord, the glory and strength that are due your name. And we worship you in the splendor of your holiness. Lord, in these uncertain and turbulent times, you are the eternal, unchanging, sure foundation upon which our hope rests, on which our security stands. Lord Jesus, you are our righteous judge and our merciful justifier. Your name is exalted above the heavens and your glory is over all the earth. Holy Spirit, we ask that you would shine in our hearts today the light of the knowledge of the glory of God in the face of Jesus Christ, that we might be transformed more and more into his likeness. As we come to you today, O oh God, some with weary and burdened souls, give us rest in you. Fill us with the joy of our salvation that we might rejoice in you always. And as we come to you and worship this morning, oh God, we pray as your son Jesus taught his followers to pray. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will be done 
on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen.